everyone what's going on my people welcome back to the channel my name is daniel so in this video i'm going to be showing you this dollar arbitrate business you can start up with and be making some good amount of money every single day okay so apparently this method works for people that reside in nigeria because we have some limitation to our cards we can't spend as much as 50 to 100 dollar every month with our card so that is why in this video i put together how you can successfully buy dollar at the rate of 425 naira and you'll be able to sell this dollar this same dollar at 705 naira and be making some good amount of money every single day okay so apparently without further ado let's dive in and if you are new to the channel you're welcome my name is daniel on this channel I'll make video about crypto arbitrage trading and arbitrage trading and cryptocurrency trading in general so if that sounds like what you're interested in i will invite you to subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell icon and give this video a like as well so apparently i also have a telegram group you can also join there and interact with guys so the idea behind this video like i said earlier is successfully buying dollar at 425 naira and we are going to transfer it into our dom account and be selling it for either the bookies or we can sell it on gray.io gray.co rather on around 705 naira and you'll be able to make some good amount of money every single day with this strategy let's say you've successfully buy this dollar at 425 naira times let's say you buy what of if a thousand dollars you're buying it 425,000 naira okay so if you successfully sell it at 705 naira probably on either your dom account which you are going to withdraw the money on your dom account and sell it to the bookies for 705 naira or you can use your dom account connected with your gray and you can sell it also on 705 naira so if you successfully sell it at 705 naira we will stand a chance to make 705 like 705,000 naira okay minus the 425,000 we are making 280,000 naira in just one trade using this um business arbitrate so apparently i'm going to go ahead now and disclose this strategy and let's dive in pretty quick okay the first requirement you need let me go to my notebook and show you the first requirement you need in order to successfully create this business is one you must have either a youtube channel but note i'm not saying you should start creating a youtube channel and start posting video that's not what i meant but have a regular youtube channel that's what i meant okay and you also have a regular blog 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 post okay blog post is pretty simple yeah, you can get it on blogger.com and you can get youtube instantly with your gmail account okay so that's the two requirement the first two requirements we are going to need to perform this kind of um arbitrate trading okay dollar arbitrate trading so the second step is actually creating an account with google at words okay if you don't know what google at words is you can also go on google and search for it and you are going to get something you can glance through and it can give you more information on what it meant by google artwork so you are going to successfully create a google artwork account and it's pretty simple anyone can create a google artwork account it doesn't require anything okay literally it's as simple as that you can go on to youtube and search on how to create a google artwork account and you'll be able to successfully create it yourself so the first one was youtube and blog post the second one was google at words so apparently the third one is actually having just a video okay but this method works perfectly on youtube okay perfectly on youtube because you are not literally having something to write for because when you are going for blogger blog, blog post you are going to have something that someone can call to action okay so apparently that needs more understanding on how to you know take those links and you know make people to click on it and where people are going to learn because it needs call to action but for youtube aspects it's pretty simple just have one video you just have 
literally one video on your YouTube account. Okay, that's like that's literally what you need. So what we are going to we are going to run an ad on that video on that particular video you have successfully created. It's going to be here just just create only one video. It might not be ten minutes. It might just be like one minute video is pretty much okay. So after you done that, you can go on YouTube and search for how to create how to create a YouTube ad. Okay, they are going they are going to walk you through on how to use Google Ads words and you know create a youtube ad and i'm running that ad on youtube okay so, and the youtube account you are running people are just going to click on it and come to your youtube and watch your silly video okay it's, it must not be an entertaining video and a very huge video just simple video of you doing random things is okay so that's the idea too and it's very simple i'm not going to like literally go in depth on this arbitrate um, opportunity i'm going to just glance you through the interface and you can successfully go out there because there are resources all over the media there are a lot of resources out there you can also research from how to create a youtube channel basically all those things are pretty much available online okay so i'm just going to glance you through on how to you know go about it so if you find it interesting you can literally implement the strategy and make money with it and if you are watching this video up to this hour don't forget to hit that like button for me. I really appreciate it. So like I said, we need a Google Ads. And the idea behind the Google Ads word is actually opening the Google Ads word. Then we phone our Google Ads word with Naira card. Okay. There are some specific Naira card that works on Google. Okay. Google will charge you 425 Naira to just phone your Google Ads word account. Because you are literally paying for this ad. Just run one ad. One ad is okay. If you check on Google... Google just charge you eight dollar to run an ad. Literally, I make that research already before I make this video. They just charge you eight dollar, probably not up to a ten dollar, if not eight dollar. You are going to be charged eight dollar to ten dollar to run an ad. The idea is now when you open an accent, a actual account rather, you use it to run a Google ad um, YouTube ad video. Okay, when you find that your um Google ad ad world account. Probably you find it like probably there are some cards that works perfectly like the G let me not disclose card here but there are some card if you come to the Telegram group I will I will give you some information about which card works best on the Google ad okay there are some card that has hundred dollar limit there are some that is fifty dollar and you require more card to fund this Google account and you might even have a domiciliary a Mastercard like card a domiciliary card. And use it to fund the Google Adword also, not only your Naira card. If you deposit money into Google Adword and you don't use it to run ads and you quickly redraw it again to your dumb account because that's the idea behind I've already exposed everything now. So that's just the idea. If you kind of do it like that, you are going to be blocked out of the Google Adword. Okay. So I want to I want you to do it in a smart way. So if you successfully fund this Google Adword. You'll be able to just spend ten dollar to run this ad, okay? So after you successfully run this ad and the days are over, maybe probably like four days, just put the four days to five days ad running, and after the end of the day, you'll be able to cancel the ad running and withdraw your money and remove the payment method. You are going to remove the Naira card payment method that you made initially when you wanted to deposit money. So when you are redrawing money, you are redrawing it to your domiciliary account, which is basically your DOM account. So you, when you redraw it to a DOM account, you have full access to your dollar now. You can even redraw it in the bank and sell it with the abokis and either to the grade or CEO. Okay, so that's the basically idea behind the video and it's pretty simple. And you can also do it on Facebook too, but Facebook own, I need to do some research about it, but it's the same application. Because Facebook also needs you to deposit money for you to run an ad on Facebook. So when you deposit money and run a little ad, you'll be able to take advantage of the opportunity after running the ad. The money left in your account, they're going to withdraw it. So that's basically the idea behind this video. And if you want more detail of it, leave it in the comment section. And, and if you find this idea interesting, give it a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.